Hi, welcome back to Jennifer's Lair. Today I wanted to talk to you about a fundraiser that I feel very deep in my heart to do. And this fundraiser is for WWF. It stands for World Wildlife Foundation. And I'm looking at a sticker. They sent me this. It's for my car and I have to put it on. But this week and well... Until springtime, I can't really do it. This week, it's supposed to get down, I think it's Wednesday. We're supposed to get down to 50 below, they're saying. That's with wind chill. It's going to be about 25 below. But with the wind chill, it'll feel like 50 below, below zero. So, not looking forward to that at all. <laughs> so, okay, we'll back into it. Um, I wanted to talk to you guys about this foundation because I feel very... You know, it's it's in my heart to give to this foundation. Um, last year, I I adopted a snow leopard. Um, if anybody knows, you've seen those commercials that play, and this commercial was playing constantly, where it had a snow leopard and it its paw was stuck in a trap. Um, that like hurt me, and um, I actually cried when I saw the commercial. Just the meow of the cat alone made me cry. And, um, well, I feel that it's important to save these animals. Uh, there's so many endangered right now, and, and the environment's in trouble. And I just feel like there's a need to save them. I mean, I would want other people to enjoy them after I leave this world. And so I would like other people to be able to see them in the wild and to know that they exist. Um, I don't want them to be a thing in the, in the past and just found in history books. Well, we used to have this animal, and we used to have this animal. Um, that's why I really want to save them. And I know I can't save them all, but I can do my part. Um, so, with that said, um, you can go on their website. Um, they have a website. Uh, just look up under World uh, Wildlife Foundation, or Fund. And you'll get it. There's actually one on Facebook, too. But I don't know if I believe the one on Facebook. Uh, just because there's been some nasty comments underneath there. And it, it's really upsetting. I don't buy that crap. I think that there's people that hate. So then they're just, you know, writing comments and stuff like that. There's a lot of hateful things said. Which I don't feel the need to repeat this. Because I'm trying to stay in the positive here by... Um, you know, sending you guys uh, this message to help, you know, to get the animals help, to get the environment help. Um, they do a lot, uh, a lot of different things. They work with the environment, the climate, to get fresh water and food, and they help the wildlife, forests, and oceans. So they do a lot. They do, like, all around, and they also... Um, save, like I said, the endangered species. There's a, if you go on the website, there's a list and you'll see it and it's full of animals. It's full of animals and they even save honeybees, which are very important by the way, because if we have no bees, we're SOL. I mean, we're basically shit out of luck because they pollinate all the flowers. They pollinate our crops. We need that. And honey, actually it does not spoil. And, um, I use it for my throat when I get a cold or whatever. I use it in like water and I, I mix it with water, cinnamon, and uh, warm water, you know. Uh, put it in the microwave for a little bit, get it warm, put the honey in. Don't put the honey in bef before you put it in the microwave. That'll, that, that'll zap the any good things that the honey's going to do for you out of that. You have to do it after you put it in the microwave. So do the, you know, fill your cup full of water first, put the honey in, and then put the cinnamon in. Um, it's a really good remedy for sore throats and colds. I, if I find that if I'm starting to even feel like a little bit of a sore throat, um, that's my go-to thing. So it may help you um, from, it may you know, nip it in the butt in the first stages. But anyways, I'm getting off course like I normally do during these videos, but it is important to, uh, it's important to save the bees. It's important to save the environment. It's important to save these animals. I can't say enough. 
But if you go on their website, they have things where you can adopt the animals. You can adopt turtles and tigers and jaguars and panthers and cougars and all kinds of big cats. They have lions and lionesses. They have, they have all kinds of different animals. They're leopards and um, just all kinds of big cats. So check that out. They also have uh, different turtles that you can adopt. They have uh, rabbits. They have uh, elk and deer and wolves and um, bison. They also have um, different types of birds that you can adopt. There's all kinds of animals. I cannot stress enough. There's so many animals, and there's some that I've never, ever heard of in my life that are on that list. So please check that out. And also, when you do um, when you do adopt, you get an adoption kit. Now, I don't know what happened to part of my adoption kit. You get a tote, you get like a, a card of what you adopted, like a picture of it. I When I got the snow leopard, I had gotten a snow leopard card that says facts on the back of it. And then you get like a little adoption um, adoption diploma type of thing. And then you also get, um, this was the one that I checked off for. I got a plushie. Isn't that cute? A little snow leopard. And it's got the World uh, Wildlife Foundation on that. I'm sorry, I don't know where my diploma thing is. I, I was going to have it framed. So, and I put it somewhere and I'm not sure where it's at. But this is the plushie. And it was, I think it was $55. I gave them $55 and I was able to adopt. And you can choose not to have a little plushie if you don't want one. But uh, it's adorable and I wanted one. It's so cute. But, um, but yeah, so you don't have to get the plushie or anything. You could just say, well, um, I just want all my money to go towards, you know, the foundation or whatever. Also, this last week, I donated again, and I got some uh, little cubs and stuff, and so I am going to do a little bit of an unboxing for you guys, and of course, um, I didn't cross off my address, so I'm, the address is towards me, but I'm going to open the box, and we're going to see what's inside the box. Um, I spent, I gave them $75 this time, last time I gave them $55. And I usually like to pick the kits up or whatever. Here's the top of the box. This is what it looks like. I know these aren't really, um, I guess it's not really uh, very popular to have an unboxing video, but I'm doing one anyways. Uh, it comes with the, a little envelope, and then I've got something with my name on it and address, so I'm not going to share that, but I got a diff another envelope here. And I will open all of this up. And then it came. Oh, they are so cute. Um, I picked a bucket full of little, little guys. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. Look at them. Oops, I'm sorry. I hit the camera. Sorry. Look, it's a little barrel. Of little guys they're so cute <laughs> I love I love them I love giving them like donations and I also like this because then you get something kind of like saying hey look I donated you know and not all the time do am I after that I don't want to like stir you the wrong way but it's just kind of fun because you're donating to them but then you're you're getting something for yourself and it's just kind of cool and it's like a little thank you I got these little guys and they seem to be stuck together <laughs> it's this one this is actually one of the things you can purchase online um, they you can get them in a tote bag or you can get them in one of these things and you can pick for uh, I think it's seventy five dollars. You get four, so maybe I didn't do maybe I didn't do the seventy five dollars. Sorry, um, it was probably like fifty five. I think it was. Anyways, since I don't remember, but um, 
you can pick like little bear, like little of these things, and then you can pick the stuffed animals that go in them. These are a lot smaller than the snow leopard is, but see, aren't they cute? Oh, here's another little snow leopard. It can go with, it can be a mom and baby set now. <laughs> and then here's another one. It's a tiger. Oh, he's so cute. I love big cats, by the way. I just adore them. They're so awesome. But, of course, I am just, I love cats in general, so. And here's this little guy. Aren't they cute? I swear to God, I'm hearing somebody downstairs. Weird. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, and I'm supposed to be home by myself. It's probably one of the cats. Hmm. That's strange. Whatever. I'll figure it out later. <laughs> if you hear me screaming, you know why. But these are the little guys I got. They're so cute. I got a, a jaguar one, a little uh, lion, or I mean a tiger, and then I got a snow leopard. They're so cute. <laughs> I love them. They're cute. I love plushies. Anyways, okay, back to the video. Sorry, I'm just getting a little <laughs> sidetracked again. Um... This is one of the things I wanted to show you too, is when you do, when you do donate, your money, 84% of it goes to the cause of it. 11% is basically the uh, uh, finance, no, not the finance, what is it? No, it's, it's a fundraising, sorry, excuse me, the fundraising part, and then the 5% is the finance. So most of your money does go towards that foundation, which, you know, I feel very wholeheartedly you need to do that foundation. You just, I'm hoping that you guys will contribute because I made this video. I want to make people aware that it's out there. Um, you can, when you go on their website, when you do, when you give the money to the foundation, you can actually give um, you can pick whatever you want to do or whatever, but you also can go to the gift page and they have keychains and t-shirts and, uh, puzzles and mugs and, you know, plushies and, um, totes and bags and a whole bunch of different things there that you can choose from. So, and all that money will go, well, the 84% of it will go towards, you know, towards the animal that of your choice possibly if that's what you choose to do or it could go back into the fund for the all around um help for the animals so i can't stress that enough i really hope that you guys see this and donate and um help this cause out because these animals need our help the environment needs our help every everything really needs our help right now we're in pretty bad shape so if anything at all that you can donate, that would be awesome. And I really appreciate, you know, um, you guys watching this video and thinking about it. Um, you know, just think about it. You don't have to do it, but please just think about it. Because, um, like I said, these animals need our help. And we're the only ones that can do it. Animals really don't have a voice, which it makes me very sad. And um, we are their voice, so we have to step up and we have to do our part. So if you can give, please go to their website and please just give. Give whatever you can, whatever you can afford. Um, I just, you know, I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart, and I'm sure the animals and whatever else you're doing to help or whatever really appreciates it. Um, I just can't stress enough how important animals are to the ecosystem, to us. 
and to, you know, um, well, I mean, I have stepchildren and I would be sad if they grew up without having those animals, like they're maybe our grandchildren someday, they might not be able to see those animals. And that would break my heart because, you know, um, there's, you know, they need our help right now. They need our help more than ever. And um, it would just break my heart to see that they aren't, um, that, they, that the animals aren't going to be around for generations to see. Um, it's our time now to do what we can to help. So I really would, I cannot stress enough how important this is. It's just very important. And I'm sorry my videos are always serious, but I am planning to do another one after this one. Um, it's just going to be like a hang with me type of video. It's going to lighten up the mood a little bit more. And hopefully you guys are all having a great day, keeping warm, I hope, and safe. It's, um, the roads here are very dangerous right now. They're slippery. There's wind blowing around all over the place. My husband had sent me a video earlier showing me how bad the roads are, and they are not fun. It looked like whiteout conditions where he was. And, and so, um, it's kind of scary out there. So I'm hoping that you're all having a great day, being safe, and keeping warm in this the in these this weather. This weather is just crazy to me. Um, we're getting we're gonna see temperatures that we haven't seen for like 20 years where I'm at. So it's actually gonna break some records here for the coldness and everything. So but anyways I hope you're staying safe and warm. Please check out the decor DIY group. Um, Please check out the um, Jennifer's Layer page on Facebook. Um, let's see, I'm trying to think. And there's artists. I did put up some artists in the DIY group the other day. Um, I'm trying to make people more aware of the, sh the Etsy stores and their, their personal shops that they have. Any artists I've asked um, to do their... Uh, to write their information down and share their pages and stuff. I sure appreciate you guys responding to that. So that means a lot because I'm trying to help out artists because I'm an artist myself. I know how it is to struggle. Get your name out there. It's very competitive. Um, you know, just trying to get stuff accomplished and things. So if I can help, if I can't help in a financial way, which a lot of times, like I said, there's so much good stuff out there that... You know, I have to rein myself in at some point. You can't just help everybody, even though I want to help everyone. I mean, I would love to help everybody, but it's just not realistic. So that's why I share things on Facebook. Even just a little bit of like and share can help people out in, in ways. And speaking of which, please like and comment uh, on this video and subscribe to my channel. Um, I'm going to try to find a schedule of it, of when I'm going to be posting videos next, but I'm not real sure at this point. Right now, I'm just starting out. I don't even have an intro, as you guys know. I don't add music because I'm, I'm kind of scared about the copyright thing. I don't want to go too far into that, but I would really like to add some music because I'm all about music. I love music, so... Um, if I could add some spice to my videos, so, you know, to make them more interesting, that would be awesome. But anyways, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for now, but I'll be back with a hanging with me type of video, okay? Well, I will see you next time, and please, please, please try to give to the World Wildlife Foundation, please. If you can, please give to them. All right, well, until next time... Stay spooky, have fun, be nice to each other, and keep warm. Until next time, bye.